Hello everyone. Welcome to the class of the device simulation. And uh, we were talking about the project two. And uh, what I asked from you that uh, you have to make the following table in the Jupyter and solve the following example at the same time. I am attaching a sample code for making the table. So I attach the code for you also in another file that you can open it in Jupyter and can use it for you at the purpose. So what is the question? Well. I, what code I shared with you, let me show you. Uh, I shared with you. I shared with you this code. We said that we are going to import the pandas, import the matplotlib, and then we made the series. Now, for example, here in this uh, example, we have uh, this table delta t, tp plus delta t, log, and pwl. So, for example, you copy this one. copy this one here and uh, here are the names look at them where are they this is the first one is delta t is already delta t the second one was the year third one was the log so you can change these these delta t tp plus delta t log t and pws with these one four round one one two three four because these are the headlines you see here this actually is already made here already done here but you have to add the value then there were values of this graph all these values are given here one two three four five these values we have to shift from here 0 0.2 0 0.3 0 0.4 as you see here to 0 0.3 0 0.4 0 0.5 1 2 4 6 7 8 and 12 1 2 4 6 8 and 12 likewise the this is the first seed first table then the second one is 1, 2, 3, 4, 5, 6, 7, 8, 9, 10. You have to, and we have to then index them. Means, for example, you want to, there are 10 values here from 0 to 8. So, for you, for example, now in some uh, calculation, you want to recall this one. So, this one is 1, 2, 3, 4, 5. So, this fourth is the number of this value of 0 0.3. Okay. Then, the second value we have here starting from 34,127,300 this one again we have 11 values here 1 to 11 so you have to put these values here okay then you have the year you put all these values log values here again 11 values we have and uh, here you can see here these are the numbers index number 1 2 3 4 5 6 7 11 12 so likewise this one so these are 11 then the third one is also 11 numbers so you have to put the value and these are their index value like which one is number one number one is zero number two here is this one so once you do this you have to put the table code and uh, because this one you name it as people dot underscore dot dict so you put the data frame this these frames first and then you write the people and then it will just plot it plot x t delta t and what you want to plot you want plot you want the plot of delta t versus pws so this command shows us that delta t and and y is w a this is the x-axis this is the y and the command is people dot plot and uh, the type is scatter we have many kinds of plots but here we are using the scatter plot so this is the and color you can change to any this is showing the color so we have two graphs and uh, the command to show is plt dot show okay plt dot show so you put this graph and plt dot show will actually show the plot plot dot show and same in the again in the end it will show the the table here so it shows it is showing the table that we have here now in the project what i want there not only this one but you have to start using the input command for example input is equal to integer okay a is equal to input sorry integer input the now the example says I want these values so QO for example QO. 
then you go for B or you can write here Q0 now the second value I want to put is mu so let's write here V as the symbol so we write integer input viscosity like this one then after you run it okay this one is a problem here somewhere so we have three Now value of Q0 you put it here let's say 300 viscosity value how much it is 0.8 and then because uh, I didn't complete it you have to complete your calculation so that's why it is showing error here so the point is that you put set up all the values then you set up an equation how you set up an equation like this one for example you have equation like a plus b okay or for example you have equation here q p mu m h so 162.6 multiply by multiply by q 0 and the viscosity multiply by viscosity multiply by formation volume factor of course you are going to define the formation volume factor also integer input formation volume factor okay you define all your inputs like this one like all them inputs and then you define your equation which are these equations q k and s first k and then s and there are some values for example the value of m you need it so first value of m you can find from the graph you have plotted just by putting the line as we do before do like that and that's all the project so you will have your table at the same time you will have your equations and you can solve this using this one this one so that's the project is about and I hope if you have any question please let me know so I will clarify it for you here. Yeah.